So here we are on day four of being in Bogota. Mira has chosen some really nice restaurants for us to explore and uh, we are at one of them. We'll let her tell you a little bit about it. All right, love. This is Casa, um, one of the architectural um, foodie places that we found here in Bogota. Um, wonderful ambiance. We started out with the lemonade, mint lemonade. Paul over here has amazing cheese croquettes. Let's see how those are. How are those croquettes, Paul? Very, very, very good. Very, 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 very good. Very, very good. Excellent. That's all I have. That's all you have for, all have for now? What are we starting off with? With their garden salad. Garden salad. What's in that, a garden salad? We have radishes, tomatoes, avocado on mixed salad. I think there's mushrooms in there too. Mushrooms as well. Yeah. Champignons. Excellent. Mm -hmm. All right, so we'll get first course in and uh, keep you abreast on how this uh, place pans out, but I think it's gonna be pretty excellent. Like the, uh, vinegar. Yeah, so the, the house salad here is, as I said a minute ago, the mushrooms, uh, avocado, I mean, just some standard field greens, radish and stuff, but the dressing is excellent. Uh, definitely a, a good first starter. Okay, so, I did realize that we introduced a new character into our story today. This is uh, Paul Beattie. Hello. Paul and I go way back to 2009. We rode uh, our motorcycles from Alaska to Argentina together, and then we have done the Nova Scotia trip together, and we did the TAC together. We've done Ireland and Wales, and uh, yeah, we've done a lot of riding, needless to say. Not enough. Uh, not enough. <laughs> One of my very, very good friends, and he just happens to be leading this trip and was the final straw for us to sign on and join. So we are uh, And I'm absolutely delighted to be doing this with you because it's just, it's just brilliant. And I love this guy. I <laughs> missed him. It's been pre-COVID yeah, pre since we've seen each other. And uh, yeah, it's just really good to, to get back together and, and go ride around the- Go ride motorcycles. Ride, ride around the entire- All day long. Around the entire south of the entire continent of South America. Yeah, it's gonna be a good time. It is. Alright. So Paul is getting ready to enjoy himself with some shrimp here at Carne. Very hot. Very hot. Very good. Would that be a recommendation? Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. For that. And then Mira, we got the oxtail. Oxtail and rice with asparagus. Mmm, look at that. That looks very tasty. It looks like there's a lot of meat. There we go. Oxtail. Okay. Asparagus. Let's see. First bite. That's wonderful. Yeah? It's really good. We'll try here. See how it, it's, how it looks really hot as hell. It's steamy. Kind of tastes a little bit like dog food. It's really good. <laughs> so I have to say, it started raining here. The ambiance is excellent. We're outside, but we're under a little cover. They keep trying to get us to move. We don't really want to. It's uh, we're, we're we're good. But in this process, uh, I tried Paul's prawns and rice, or shellfish and rice. It is. It is uh, uh, definitely the one to choose uh, if you're gonna pick one of these meals from this restaurant. Like, it's excellent. Kind of semi-joking about the oxtail tasting like dog food. Semi-joking. So while we wait out the rain, because we have to walk back to the hotel, uh, you know, we're just kind of forced to, well, we're moved inside and then we're kind of forced to have to get dessert. You know, it is forced. So, Paul got this beautiful brownie ice cream sandwich that just looks so good. 
And it has chocolate, liquid chocolate too. I mean, and then, yeah, look at that. Like, Ooh. just, Jesus. Yeah, that is so good. So good. <laughs> and then we got the tres leches, which was the number one recommended dessert for this location. Can you take a look at that? It kind of has like three nipples. It's perfect. Four. Four one's, nipples. One's droopy. One droopy nipple. Yeah. Anyway, that looks very, very tasty. Do you want to give it the first shot, love, or do you want me to? Survey says really good. All right. Oh, uh, oh, I have my own. Go. We'll give it a little taste. Make sure it gets in the thing there. Here we go. Excellent. So it has um, a lot of subtle flavors. Very complex. Very, very good. Highly recommend it. Yeah, tres leches. Very, very good. Yes, sir. So we just finished up our meal at Casa. What would you guys say? How was it? What do you think? Oh, it was very good. Excellent, actually. Would you come back? Oh, definitely come yes, back. Yes, definitely. Yeah. Sit inside. Sit inside. <laughs> nah. Take the chance. Sit on the patio on the back. It's gorgeous. Just a little rain. Never hurt anybody. What was your favorite thing about Casa tonight? My favorite thing about Casa was the dessert. The dessert? Yeah. Ah. Well, I guess that's a little shot in the heart because I was going to say... The company. The company. <laughs> <laughs> Nothing but love. 